Hey YouTube, this is Jay from Jay's Mel Show coming at you with another headbang video. I hope you guys are awesome today. And if you guys can see, I'm back in the hospital again due to me having a, another pain crisis. I was trying to, you know, take care of it as much as I could all weekend, but it just got really bad like last night and early this morning and I just had to go but I will be okay you know try not to worry about me too much um but that's not what I want to talk to you guys about I want to do a male head advice video about be careful who you call your friends and know the difference between friends and associates because I believe, well, I personally believe, in my opinion, a lot of people get those two, you know, those two things mixed mixed up or misunderstood. Some people think that a friend is a associate or a associate is a friend. In my experience, you know, I've had, I, I'm a very... I could get along with uh, almost anybody, you know, but I'm very particular who I call my friend because I have been hurt and before by people who I thought were friends, especially when I was much younger, you know, but I believe personally a friend is someone who is there for you through the good and bad who will tell you when you're wrong, who will be patient to you, um, and who, who won't hurt you physically, mentally, emotionally, you know, and who will be there for you through the good times and the bad times. And, you know, an associate can do those things too, but not like a true friend. And, I believe, well, my wonderful mother, if you're watching this, mom, hey, mom. But my mom used to tell me, my siblings, pick your friends like you pick your fruit. You don't want to go get fruit that is rotten on the outside. You know what I'm saying? You don't want, you know, to get fruit that looks nasty and all that type of stuff because if you do it can make you sick and that's kind of like you know with people if you're trying to look for friends like you well I will speak for me I will want to have a friend who is kind who has goals and plans you know who is honest who is compassionate and patient, who is not violent or, you know, abusive in any way, and who won't influence, try to influence me to do wrong, you know, and vice versa. You know what I'm saying? Um, I will want a friend to be there for me through when I'm sick and when I'm well, when I'm happy, or when I'm extremely depressed, when I feel alone, or when I don't feel alone, and vice versa, because it, in friendship, it has to be both ways. You can't, one person can't just do all the work. You gotta, to keep the friendship alive and healthy, you both have to put in work. You know, one you had to put in fifty percent, and the other person had to put fifty percent. Not thirty, um, not thirty, you know, percent, and the other person does, um, sixty, or you know, you you guys get the, get the drift. But my point is, be careful who you call your friends, because not everyone is your friend. Just because someone laughs with you, smiles at your face, you know, take you out a, a few times, buy you stuff, um, say kind things to you, may not mean you well. 
you know, there's been a lot of cases. Well, with me, I have had a lot of people who I thought were my friends who would, you know, do those things. And I find out that they're talking bad about me, who they, you know, that they would mistreat me, take advantage of my take advantage of me and that's another thing don't let a friend well a person who you think is a friend try to take advantage of you because a friend won't do that you know my hair is a little itchy sorry but a friend won't take advantage of you and a friend will want you to be be a better person a good friend at least in my opinion you know for me i won't want you guys to evolve and do good and have goals and treat people good treating yourself good you know doing the right thing i'm not down for to doing the wrong thing i'm not down with doing illegal stuff i'm not down with abusing people you know but that is just me everyone is different and everyone has a different taste of who they call their friends and you know and that's okay you know, you you get along with who you get along with. But, again, pick your friends like you pick your fruit. Because, again, birds who flock to... Birds who flock... When I, it's a saying. It's an old, old, old folk saying um, that basically if, basically if you are around that person long enough whoever you hang around with you will eventually become that is what i'm trying to say i'm in a lot of pain and it's hard for me to think but you know who that's another reason why you have to be careful who you like call your friends because however they are with their personality traits and all that type of stuff you may be totally different but if you stay around them and they're not you know, a good influence, you know, they're not doing the right thing, all that type of stuff. They're doing things that are not good and you condone it and you think it's cool and everything, eventually you will become that or you will start to be, be like them. So, you know, I would want to be around people who, you know, are good people because I don't want to turn out turned into a bad person or a person who I don't recognize when I look in the mirror or I don't want to turn to a person who I end up hating. You know, I don't want to hate myself, you know. But if I, that's all I really want to tell you guys. You know, be careful who you call your friends. Not everyone who you think is a friend it's not your friend. They just may be a associate or n neither, you know. But you guys will always have a friend in me, Jay from Jay's Mo Show. You guys will, you know, if you got, if any of you need someone to talk to, you know, don't be afraid to reach out to me. Just like I reached out to you guys in my last video. Um, and by the way, thank you to everyone who commented down below, commented and sent me messages and reached out to me. That really, really did help because I was feeling really, really low and that helped me a lot. And I ex truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you guys. And I love you guys for that, you know. And again, if you, if any of you need a friend to talk to, if you feel alone, or you know you need someone to just listen to you, I'm here if you if you so choose. And my Facebook page and my Twitter page will be you know the links will be down below if you want to follow me, you know. And sh share this video if you end up liking this video, like comment if you haven't subscribed to the channel subscribe it's free 99 won't cost you a thing and i love each and every one of you i will be just fine you know i've been going through this illness pretty much oh well all of my life and i will can i will be i will continue to be strong and you know
I'm Leo. I'm Leo the Lion, and I'm pretty tough, you know. But um, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. You are loved. You are worthy. You are special just the way you are. I do have a pre-recorded video coming out on Wednesday for you guys. The second episode of Jay's Choice. Um, oh, and by the way, it's just to look to let you guys know ahead of time the intro of i accidentally put in my old intro rather than my regular intro because you know i was in a lot of pain and, and you know i just forgot you know to put in my newest intro rather than my old intro so if it's you know, if you guys are taken back because it, it doesn't sound like my typical intro that's why and you know I will put in my newest intro in my in future videos for you guys. Um, and I hope you guys have a headbanging week. And um, if you if you know anyone that needs to hear hear this message, don't be afraid to share it. Like, comment, um, like this video, comment down this video below. And you already know the drill. Like I'm gonna say. Stay alive. Well, until next time, folks. Stay alive. Always stay heavy. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.